What's up? How y'all doing? <laughs> Seth, obviously everybody knew you could run when you got here. What's it been like to show that there's a lot more to your game than that? Um, well, I think running is my best tool, but I've always been able to hit as well. So uh, just showing that I can do that. Did you think about you know going up to this level and you know obviously the arms are different you know mm -hmm. a little bit. I mean I know you see some special guys in JUCO, but yes, you know, were you excited to prove yourself to prove you could hit at this level too? Uh, yeah. Um, just really coming out here and, and having fun and just competing every AB, just seeing what I can do. Um, but yeah, that's the main thing. Yeah, I played both second and left this weekend. Do you prefer either? Have it better comfort level at either? Uh, I played infield at my junior college. Um, this is my first time in outfield, but I'm pretty comfortable out there. So I like them both. And in that leadoff spot, filling in some for some big shoes. Just what are the expectations, and did you meet them this weekend? Oh uh, yeah, just. Uh, like Coach V says, just get on base and, um, and make things happen. And that's the only thing I'm really trying to do. Have you been surprised? Like playing in this environment this weekend in front of all these fans? Uh, it's great. It's, um, I kind of took a knee in, in pregame and just looked around and just saw how beautiful everything was. And, and we have the best fans, I think, I mean, that I've ever been around or um, yep. seen in college baseball so far. So it's a really cool experience. You have to pinch yourself that you're out in left field. I know you talked about you played infield mainly uh -huh. at JUCO, but you have to kind of yeah. pinch yourself that you're out there this early in the year. Uh huh. Um, I think it's pretty cool just because, uh, I mean, any way I could get in the lineup. So um, getting out there, and I like it because I get to show my speed a little bit too, running around. So what was kind of your first thought when Coach, I guess, approached you and talked to you about playing out in the outfield? Um, he kind of just stuck me out there in some uh, scrimmages. So I've just been, ever since I got back in the spring, I've been working on it. When did you know you were going to be the leadoff hitter Friday night? Uh, the minute I walked in the locker room, saw the lineup. <laughs> what goes through your mind when you see that? I mean, you're like, okay, yeah. I like that. Uh, I mean, I've been a leadoff my whole life, so um, I feel comfortable in that position. You mentioned just finding any spot to play. What's the competition been like in the middle infield and fall in the preseason? Um, I mean, I think we got some of the best middle infielders in the country, so uh, anybody could play, and uh, I think it's a matter of you know who's hitting and who's going to just make the routine plays. And they're doing a great job out there, so wherever I can play. Y'all are replacing a bunch of dudes from last year's team. I think scoring 33 runs in three games kind of gives y'all some proof that y'all are capable of filling those shoes. Yeah, um, I, I talked to some fans um, walking out of practice and some scrimmages in the fall, and their question was if we were going to be able to hit as good as last year's team. And I think, I think we are. I think we could show that this weekend. What's it been like playing with Jordan Beck, a guy like that that's always a threat to drive you in? Uh, it's pretty fun to watch him just take BP and, uh, I mean, just the way he swings it, it's, it's pretty cool getting behind there and watching him hit. You always know that uh, he, get, he can drive one out or hit one hard in AAB, so it's pretty fun. Any more for Scott? All right.